What's up guys? I got a super fun makeover video for you guys today. Make sure you stay tuned until the end to see the before and afters. You guys are not going to believe this. So I start off cutting everything with no elevation and then I go finger elevation all the way through the rest of the cut. Basically following parallel to that parting and following parallel to the jawline. Then once I get to that parietal ridge area, I go in with my Blend 20 Elite scissor uh, and I just work the ends with that Blend Elite and what that does just softens the ends so that the line isn't so harsh and you get a nice soft fall to your long bob. I continue through, cut my line using the FSE Precision Elite 5.5 inch scissor and then I elevate and I go in with my Blend 20 Elite to soften the line. As you guys can see, my salon is so beautiful and it's thanks to my friends at MinervaBeauty.com. If you guys are looking to upgrade your salon furniture, they have the best prices and the best furniture in the business. So go check them out, MinervaBeauty.com. All right, so now we work into the left-hand side of the head. Same thing, mimicking the jawline. I tilt her head just a little bit to add a little comfort uh, and it makes it a little easier to cut around her shoulder. But just following that line, slight elevation, keeping everything nice and soft. Once again, we get to that parietal ridge area and I grab my Blend 20 Elite Scissor from freesaloneducation.com and I just work to soften those ends. You can already see the beautiful texture coming through. Can't wait to show you guys this end result. So now I want to go in and make the ends nice and lightweight so that in the style nothing looks too heavy. So I grab my Blend 20 Elite Scissor, I do a little bit of point cutting just to keep everything nice and soft and lightweight. You can see how buttery smooth that scissor goes in and removes that weight. A Little bit of slide cutting in the face frame, a little bit of slide cutting in the back. Now the cutting's done, we add a little bit of wave to the hair, and then here you go. Here's the before and the after. Check it out, guys. Uh, this beautiful copper tone using Kenra hair color. If you wanna know that formula, let me know in the comments below. Let me know what you think, guys. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel. I'll see you on the next video. Thanks.